what's up you guys? Marty Schwartz here of Marty Music. Thanks again for tuning in. Now, live performances are always fun because you never really know what to expect. But a few musicians and concerts take the anything can happen vibe to the next level. Here are seven of the wildest stage stunts in rock history. Number seven, Eddie Vedder monkeys around. Eddie Vedder, singer, songwriter, activist, and possessor of crazy upper body strength. He's famous for using the stage setup. It's kind of a jungle gym, you know, in Pearl Jam's early festival days. There's tons of awesome footage of him dangling from the rafters and doing all kinds of other crazy stuff. Oh man. Number six, Flaming Lips Hamster Ball. <laughs> that was so awesome. Now an integral part of the band's performances, the giant plastic hamster ball utilized by Flaming Lips frontman Wayne Coyne was truly crazy to see the first few times around. Stage dives are one thing, but walking on top of the crowd? That's so much cooler! Number five, Jimi Hendrix's flaming guitar. Now Hendrix setting his guitar on fire is a legendary rock moment, that's for sure. But think about how scary it must have seemed at the time. Guitar smashing, sure, that's been done. Leave it to Jimmy to take it to the next level, as well as terrifying the fire marshals. Number four, butthole surfers, everything. In the mid to late 80s, butthole surfers live shows were out of control. And I don't mean they were loud. They were intense, crazy performance art style concerts, including everything from sprinkling the crowd with urine, ripping their clothes off, hitting each other with beer bottles. And on at least one occasion, the band members had sex with one another? With a name as out of this world as the butthole surfers, what do you expect? Number three, Ozzy's Bat Bite. This is one you may already know. At the height of Ozzy's drug problems, a fan in Iowa tossed a bat on stage. And Ozzy, thinking it was rubber, eh, bit off its head, why not? Uh, he had to get a rabies shot too because the bat bit him back. But my question is this, who brings a live bat to a concert? Number two, L7's tampon toss. Technical difficulties plagued L7's set at the Reading Festival back in 1992, and in frustration, singer Danita Sparks tossed a tampon into the crowd, a used one. What is it about rock stars and biohazards? Number one, Sinead O'Connor rips the Pope. Sinead O'Connor's career never recovered after she tore up the picture of Pope John Paul II on SNL. But here's the thing, she did it as a protest against child molestation in the Catholic Church, which was being covered up at the time. But she's the one who lost her career. Sinead gets the number one spot for taking a stand and paying the price. Now what's the wildest stage stunt you've ever seen? Go ahead and let me know in the comments below. And also, thanks again for supporting me right here at Marty Music. If you're so inclined, you can subscribe to Marty Music to stay up to date with my newest content and videos. Thanks again, we'll see you later.